Listen to the wind blows, watch the sun rise. Running in shadows, damn your love, damn your life. And if you don't love me now, then you'll never love me again. I can still hear you saying, you will never break the chain. And if you don't love me now, then you'll never love me again. I can still hear you saying We would never break the chain Hello everybody, I'm Vasco and today I'll show you how I'm playing The Chain by Fleetwood Mac on the ukulele. We'll be doing it in the original key on a high G string ukulele, so grab yours and let's go. Okay, so let's start with the intro. Basically what I'm doing is I'm grabbing G major 7 like this and then being ready to grab E minor while still holding the bar there for the G major 7. And basically we're just going between these two while mostly we're playing E minor but sometimes we hear this second fret of the E string which is part of the G major 7. And after that we go to the verse, which basically starts with E minor. And again on E minor we're playing with this thing on the C string, second to fourth fret. So the E minor I'm grabbing throughout the whole song is basically a G major 7 with the ring finger on the fourth fret as well, playing sometimes releasing it. And also the middle finger on the third fret of the E string, sometimes releasing this. Okay, so we're playing E minor to A major and then we have this D6 which is basically just the second fret barred to C6 which is all the strings open and getting back to E minor. So let's try it. Listen to the wind blow Watch the sunrise. And on D6 and C6, I'm doing a little pick, something random. Basically, strum. I'm strumming enough so that I'm just doing something random with these hands. Uh, it's really impossible to do it properly on the ukulele with the exact tones, but I think that this is pretty similar to what it is in the original recording. And then we go to the chorus, which basically starts with A minor this time. And if you don't love me now, then you'll never love me again. To E minor, to C6, and here we have D suspended for to D. All right. And if you don't love me now, then you'll never love me again. I can still hear you saying you could never break the chain. Then we'll never love me again. I can still. And we get back to the interlude, which is basically E minor, and we are doing this thing with sometimes to G major seven, back to E minor. 
And after that, we have another verse, another course. And after the second chorus, we go to the break, which is basically E minor to A minor. And we have this grabbing on the E string second, releasing to open, then C string. Okay, so it sounds like this. And after that, we go to the bass part. We can call it bass solo, although it's not really a solo. It's just all the instruments get quiet and just the bass is doing something like this. All right. So we'll try to do this on the ukulele. It's two or three octaves higher, but it's still the same note. So I think that it's still recognizable. So let's see how we're doing this. I'll come a little bit closer to show you. So I'm grabbing A minor. And then on the A string, open two. On the three, I'm playing C chord. Okay, and then getting back, open G string, open A string, second, grabbing E minor. All right, so. And here on the E minor, it's better to accent more on the E string and less on the rest, if you can. Okay. And basically, slowly we build up the dynamics and this is also the... Shadows change, keep us together. Running in the shadows. All right, pretty much this sums up my tutorial for the chain by Fleetwood Mac. It will be very helpful if you have the printable in front of you. You can get it from the link in the description. Make sure you request songs in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.